haunting place. It's time to share some insight from the philosopher's nook. In this little corner of the haunting place, we shall explore insights into the nature of haunting and creating a deep sense of emotional impact within stories, media and people. In tonight's moment of reflection, we confront the ghost you will become. A ghost is usually believed to be the spirit of a person long since displaced from this world. The wraith and vardorga that permeate the realms of the living to seek solace, if but for a moment. For the life lived hard and the death that spat a bitter epilogue. The fragmented pieces of what is left behind when the last breath is taken and only the silence remains. Often people, when imagining a ghost, picture in their mind a somewhat comical figure cloaked in a sheet with large black eyes or an ethereal vapour that wafts a path of lonely repetition from here to there. Throughout the human experience, we have huddled around the warming fire and told tales of those phantoms in the night. Yet the ghost you will become is not some strangely esoteric thing, an eerie frivolity told to frighten children or manipulate adults into conforming. The macabre tale reserved for the witching hour and the dark corner. The ghost you will become is the moments of interaction you commit to the world, in the words you write and the actions you take. It is the little shards of time where you made another person feel supported or used their weakness as a weapon. It is in every video and every sound recording, in the blog posts and the Facebook updates, It is every TikTok and post-it note, every photograph and doodle. The ghost you will become is not the ether. It is a coalescence, an accumulation, a farrago of all you were and are and have the potential to inspire within others. Those who never got to know you or have yet to be born will not see you hidden away in the night but on their screens and devices, on the pages of the books you have written, on the walls where your art adorns. They'll find you in the words of wisdom you offer and the compassion you shared through your message. They will look for you, seek you out and embrace you, not as the ghost of nightmares, but as the spirit of their adventure and the way you help them to navigate the storm whether that be in 200 years or tomorrow. For your legacy may last millennia, but your legacy exists now with every choice and each endeavour. So who is the ghost you will become? And what is their worth? A week? A month? A year? Or a lifetime? Every moment you embody in this life, make it a haunting place. Mm -hmm.